When using the speed right fault finder, it's imperative that you start using it at the beginning of the fence that's the closest point to the energizer or the outlet from the energizer. If your fault finder shows zero amps or no current flow, then your fence is in tip top condition. If you have a multiple wire electric fence, it's important that you measure each wire individually to account for all of the current flow on your fence line. At that point, the fault finder will look at your whole fence system and let you know whether you have any shorts and if you do, just how bad they are. You can then travel along your fence line using the fault finder at 100 meter intervals to measure not only your voltage, but also your current flow to easily find the fault. One of the features of the Speedrite Fault Finder remote control is that it has not only the current flow, but also the voltage on the same screen. So it's possible to see at a glance the condition of your fence and also your fence voltage. Also with the Speedrite Fault Finder, there are no earth leads required. Simply place your hand across the foil on the back, that earths the fault finder and gives you a more accurate reading. When placing the fault finder on the fence, it's an easy clip system that doesn't allow for any accidental shocks. The Speedrite Fault Finder can be purchased in store or on our brand new e-commerce website using the link on screen or in the description. store.pggwrightson.co.nz